sunrise in my eyes Just like a new day A breath of fresh air in my life I don't know how and don't know why But I'll, I'll be toasting all my life So just so you know, there's a lot of activity going on around the van right now, and I'll, I'll explain all of that in a bit. I've actually had a couple of false starts creating this video because, uh, number one, I lost part of my tripod. Go figure. Uh, um, and uh, so I walked a ways away from the van where I could get some good um, light when the sun was going down. And uh, everything went fine until I got back and realized I don't have any audio. Anyway. The topic is, uh, what is the topic? Saddle Mountain. Uh, Saddle Mountain is about a half hour due west of Phoenix. And it wasn't all that far away from the uh, Black Canyon that we were in before. We enjoyed ourselves at, at Saddle Mountain. The only reason that we left largely was because I had to, uh, I had to resupply. I wish I would have known how nice it was gonna be and I could have stayed a couple of extra days, but as it turns out, this life often does. Hey, buddy. It was all for the best anyway. I'll get to that in a minute. So, Saddle Mountain, beautiful, perfect weather. Didn't see any scorpions, not scorpions. I didn't see any tarantulas there like the last location. Found a, a, rather, large, uh, a rather large lizard. But other than that, it was just beautiful. I mean, it was um, a beautiful sunsets against the uh, backdrop of the... Uh, the Saddle Mountain, and it was really easy to get to, so I have no complaints. I was, it was really a pleasure staying there, and of course the dogs loved it. Um, it takes them usually a couple of days before they feel like they own the place, and, and Saddle Mountain was no different. I have to say though that I am developing somewhat of a um, cactus curiosity. Yeah, I am uh, a Sawaru dork, I think officially now. And uh, I think, you know, I'll, I'll, in fact, what I'll do is I'll tell you what I learned about the Sawarus. Maybe you'll find it interesting. Maybe you're a, a closet Sawaru dork like I am, or maybe you'll just roll your eyes. But um, anyway, here's some more footage of, of Saddle Mountain, and uh, maybe this will give you a little bit more detail on, uh, in regard to just how beautiful this was. Enjoy. <music> Sawari, so the Sawaru dorky facts are, one, the only place that you're going to find the Sawaru cactus is in the Sonoran Desert in Arizona. You'll find them no other place on the planet. Now, they also have pleats in the cactus, cacti, cactus, um, so when they fill up with water, they can expand. Now, in its first eight years of life, it can get to 
about an inch and a half tall. That's it. They grow super slow. As a matter of fact, when it's 50 years old, it gets its first arm. Now these things can get up to, um, what, 150, 200 years old. And they're not considered to be adults until they're 125 years old. I know, just dorky cacti facts. Um, we did run into a dead saguaro, the first one that I've seen. I know I've lived a sheltered life. Um, but I, I was surprised at the actual, these branches that are on the, uh, on the inside are, are solid and they're, they're, they're quite sturdy. Uh, apparently they use them for building roofs and uh, fences and even furniture. So um, yeah, go figure. I had no idea. You, know, you look at this monster, right? Um, and it, I just have no idea what's on the inside. Well, now you know. Uh, at Saddle Mountain, there was this one part of the mountain though. Um, now, of course, the saguaros are all over the place. But there was one cactus on this bluff that I was looking at, and it was a monster. So I took my tripod out there before I lost the piece, put my telephoto on, and I tried to get a pretty close-up shot. But it's really difficult to, to, uh, to quantify just how tall this is. You'll have a much better idea if you're sitting at the base of the mountain and looking at it and how big this thing is. My guess is it had to be 25, 30 feet tall. It was an absolute monster. So the reason that there is so much, so much, so much, the reason that there is so much activity around me is that I am boondocking at the Blue Water Casino in Parker, Arizona. So I am in the back of the parking lot with a group of people and we're sort of in a holding pattern until this event starts that we wanted to go to. It's called a van build. It's a community um, and volunteer event. I'll create a video just about that and give you more information. But it was really cool. I mean, I was at the laundromat doing my laundry, ran into probably three or four or five, I guess four or five different people that are on the road full time. And I ran into Wes, a Wes, and we started talking and um, uh, he offered to, uh, you know, have me hang out with these guys over at the casino, uh, many of which are YouTubers, so maybe they can give me a tip or two because I'm freaking clueless, man. But anyway, no, it's, it's, we hung out last night, um, had some laughs, had some fun. The dogs got to play a bit with some new people and some new, uh, and some new dogs too. It's, it's been a real pleasure. The only downside is, is that I lost part of my tripod and of course my audio wasn't working. And of course I hope it's working now. The meter thing is metering, so I'm, I'm, I'm reasonably optimistic. Anyway, look, I know that this is a, a pretty short update. Uh, I'll have more uh, regarding this van build uh, here soon. Uh, but for now, this is going to have to suffice. But uh, again, everybody's happy, everybody's healthy, and uh, we're enjoying ourselves. And it's nice to have some new friends to, to hang out with. It's, it's been a real honor. I, although I, I must say I was getting pretty good at speaking dog there for a while because we were sort of... I was sort of in my own little world for a bit, if you know what I mean. Anyway, look, have a good time. Um, I'm Tim. I am still untethered. And I'm still having a great time. So, oh, and of course, the usual time lapse. Have fun. Bye. I played the dice right And let the good times roll One knee and one ring Forever it's our show I don't know how and don't know why But I'll, I'll be toasting all my life